asked why I chose economics as my profession and I said it's because it helps to improve people's everyday lives. Still today I strongly believe in that. Economic stability is important for countries. I experienced the Peruvian hyperinflation when I was growing up and saw the pain that it caused in my country. In my work as an economist I tried hard to help avoid this type of crisis. I had the privilege to contribute to discussions on fund programs, which are, at the end of the day will improve the way the fund interacts with country members. I work at the communications department of the IMF and we explain to the world what the IMF does and in this way we increase public understanding and awareness at the local level and international level. Sometimes the work we do at the fund can be perceived as detached from the troubles people face day to day, but the truth is that the work that we do affects our quality of life and the quality of life of our children. Through our advice, we try to help country authorities make the best possible policy decisions which affect millions of people. I am the mission chief for Peru. My team and I follow economic developments in Peru and in the rest of the world very closely, and we offer policy advice. At the end of the day, we hope to contribute to the implementation of good economic policies that lead to economic growth and social progress. Twice a year, the IMF brings together 188 countries for the biggest workshop on the global economy in the world. My job is to make that forum possible. Ministers, governors of central banks, bankers, academics, they all come together to listen to each other, to learn from one another. I am the alternate executive director for Peru. We have the honor to be the host of the 2015 annual meetings. Mm -hmm.